I felt I was pretty observant before, but this gives me a whole new take on, on observation. Seeing how, how more things link to each other. I learn how water flows, I learn how wind blows, I learn how and why the soil is that way. And I learn the patterns of nature, basically, and how to recognize them. Being surrounded by really excitable people that are all nerding out about the same stuff. <laughs> it's a really intensive, wonderful, life-changing experience that teaches you so much about our ecosystems, ourselves, how to handle soil and water and earthworks and social justice. It really envelops all sorts of wonderful topics that are beneficial for our lives and our communities. The stuff that we learned in this course has been really inspiring and making me think that even just a small project actually has a big impact and, and learn what the root of our problems in the world are coming from. Gaining a new perspective, be able to see not only nature but community and people in the earth and all the systems that are connected together and how it is so incredibly productive if you just stop talking for a second and just sit down and listen. Quand j'ai vu qu'ils offraient le cours de durée de deux semaines, j'ai décidé de m'inscrire euh, et ça a été une des meilleures décisions que j'ai pu prendre euh, dans ma vie. I'm Graham Calder and I'm the founder and chief designer at BC Permaculture. I'm also the main teacher for all of our courses and our permaculture design certificate. The permaculture design course is specifically a internationally recognized curriculum that was designed to be able to learn pattern observation, learn how to read landscapes in a way that we can use those observations to design solutions to problems. For me, permaculture really revolutionized my hope that I have in the world and my perspective on the scenarios that we live in today and the paradigm that we believe in. And graduating university with honorary degree in depression, as I like to say, permaculture very much brought me out of that darkness and into some form of light, understanding that we as a society have a very important and positive role to play and we can play that role if we only know how, if we only knew about the positive past that we share as a species and the importance of the role that we can have when we are connected to an ecosystem. So for me what's so important is helping people to overcome these moments of despair and depression and learn to articulate their needs and the needs of their clients and the needs of their projects in ways that we can design ecological solutions to meet them. This year is our first year ever doing a pre-PDC online preparatory course and I was blown away. To be honest, the change in the attitude, energy, and knowledge base of the student, I guess I underestimated how much of the content would be retained and, and really how much we would have to review or not during the course. But the students arrived as if it was already you know, day seven of the PDC. The questions, the comments, the discussion were so much more rich this year than they ever have been. It was amazing. It was like we had just done a three-week PDC together and they've done an entire week of prep online beforehand. This has been so successful for us that we're actually planning on expanding this online course so that way we can offer even more hands-on and practical knowledge and even step away from the whiteboard and into the woods to continue our hands-on teaching at the farm since we can now ensure that the theory is really going to be digested well online. Some of my highlights were uh, spending time around the fire, swimming down by the river, learning with, with other people who who had that same fire. And when you're with that same people, just the, uh, the, the fire grows, you know. Iron sharpens iron. Grandma was one of my favorites. Um, just somebody like um, connecting with land and um, understanding that like culture is a connection to land and wherever you are. The day that we did the earthworks and actually like digging the land up and getting to to picture in real life like how uh, the earthworks we were creating were gonna change the water flow across the land. Activity that where you 
take this knowledge that's just like some thoughts and concepts and then you really translate it into something real. And, and you can see all the, 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 the functions and the pattern that you've learned and now you apply it to something. I think to me was this transition that like to take the, those concepts and, and translate them to the hands-on activity. Those are all highlights to me. Today we did our final project, so there was a lot of nervous energy coming into today, whether we'd get it done on time, whether it'd be good enough and all this kind of stuff. So we got that done, it felt great to get that done, and then it was actually really interesting. The uh, I didn't really understand the show and tell thing going in, I didn't even know what we were really doing, but it ended up being like a little sort of uh, piece of everyone's life and a little piece of their personality that came out just for a two minute presentation. And it was really interesting to see that and then Everything was done and we got our certificate and there's a little celebration. So today was probably the highlight, I think. A lot of theory, a lot of practice, a lot of learning new techniques, uh, working with people, meeting new people. It was really, really intense, but I feel like I got a lot out of it. I think what I've really appreciated is to be with everyone. Kram is really generous. Tu vois qu'il est passionné, il adore ce qu'il fait, puis de pouvoir faire, mettre en application, c'était vraiment important, puis ça l'aide vraiment à, à le vivre, tu sais, c'est pas juste comme dans un livre, c'est de venir vivre l'expérience avec tout le monde, c'était vraiment riche, ça. To me, permaculture is a lifestyle and a way of life. It allows us to reconnect with all of the systems that make us, that make this world, that make this universe. It allows you to observe in a completely different perspective. When you're looking for your courses, it's important to know that the people that are putting them on, it's like coming from a really genuine place. Um, and that is something I felt really, really strongly from the instructors and the people hosting us. Um, it was real and honest, and they're very generous. If you itch, you're playing on the train of nature. You're going to go far, you're going to go fast, and it keeps on giving. It never stops giving. It's selfless. Nature is so selfless. Life can't be meaningless because every action we do, every thought that we decide to cling to, it all has an impact, whether we, we, we know it or not. So that's why life is very, very meaningful. We just never know how, uh, how huge the repercussions of anything that we choose to do in this life. So have hope. <laughs>